Hey friends, welcome back. My name is Tiffany and today I'm going to be vlogging and bringing you along with me for some fun. So I am about to leave. I have been invited to a new spa that opened here in town, a new day spa, and it's pretty uh, fancy compared to other things that I've been to, but I was invited to try out one of their top facial and like upper massage type um, Really? So my lighting is changing up here. My husband's doing that. He's not even home and he's changing the color of my lights. Thank you, Phillips, for giving my husband some fun and shenanigans while I'm trying to record. Hold on. Anyway, as I was saying, I was invited to come experience one of their top facials. It's an 80 minute facial massage and treatment with like seaweed and stuff. Super excited. Um, so I'm gonna be heading out to do that momentarily. I've also got some errands and stuff to run under after that, depending on how I'm feeling. Um, we've got some stuff going on with the kids this evening. So there's just a lot going on today. And I haven't vlogged in a few weeks, so I thought today would be perfect. So I'm hoping to show you some bits and pieces inside the spa. This spa is located in Lexington, Kentucky, if you're somewhat local. It's called the Woodhouse Day Spa. Ready to go get some pampering. This mama needs it. What mama doesn't need it? All right. So I've just arrived, and I forgot to mention, I did shower this morning. I know um, I'm not getting like full body massage or anything, but I did shower and wash my hair and face and everything, obviously, because I wanted to make sure that I looked somewhat presentable for the day, because I do have other stuff going on today. Uh, I didn't put on makeup, though. I just showered and then moisturized, and then basically left it simple. Um, my friend that works here had said they'll wash off makeup and anything anyway, but I was like, why put on makeup to leave the house just to have it washed off? So this is basically a naked face. Um, I'm excited. So I'm gonna go ahead and check in and try and just get some clips around the lobby and like, I don't know, I don't know what to expect. So I'm bringing you along because this is not something this mama usually gets to experience. So let's go inside. so that was amazing from the moment I stepped through the door like five-star service um, beautiful facility everyone was super great it was so relaxing so I got I went in and checked in they took me to the locker room gave me the most comfortable robe I have ever put on and then some sandals and I put my stuff in the locker and then I went to the quiet room or the relaxation room spent a little bit of time in there just kind of like relaxing and uh, complimentary mimosa so that was nice after a little bit she came in my esthetician came and got me took me back to the room it was an 80 minute facial that included um, like a little bit of scalp massage arm and hand and feet massage but it was just it was so nice she said so I'm 35 and I don't think I have great skin and she said my skin looked great, especially for my age. There was no signs of sun damage, no signs of fine lines, um, which was, I mean, I guess I know I don't have fine lines and stuff, but 
Um, I do have congestion and large, like a lot of blackheads through my nose and stuff. And she was able to extract some of that after all the treatments. But there's a lot of sea seaweed involved <laughs> and it, it kind of made me want sushi if I'm being honest. Um, but yeah, five stars. It was so nice. But I actually have to get back on the other side of town and go get my children. Uh, Will is home from work. We are going to the Boy Scout shop tonight to pick up some stuff for Jackson's Derby car because the Pinewood Derby is on the 15th. So we need a few things for that. Um, he and Jackson and Jack's um, Dunmaster and their, his little boy are going tomorrow to go get their Derby cars cut at a wood shop here in town. Um, so that's, we have to run back and get that stuff. What else? I was going to stop at the library and check the P.O. box and go um, through the car wash, but I actually don't have time. I might have time to drop off the library book because it's a drive through so that might work. And then get the kids, go home. They have to do homework and reading. Four o'clock I have to meet a few of the Cub Scout committee members up at the bank so that they can add me onto the account so I can help with financials. But that was wonderful. It was amazing. Woodhouse Day Spa. Um, this is the one in Lexington. Top notch. Would highly recommend. I'm gonna go get my kids now. What are we doing here? We are going to get my stuff for my derby car. Derby car. Yeah. Alice just noticed that horse over there. All around like Lexington area, there's always horses, huh? Hey, Mama. hey can buddy. I get a birdie tarantula? No. Why not? Because I said no. Where are we eating at tonight? Buffalo, buffalo, wild wings. wings. They were very confused. They're like, it's the one with the bull, and there's wings. Are you excited? What are you getting to eat? Speak loud. It's loud in here. I am getting the popcorn chicken boneless wings. Boneless wings with mild hot sauce on it. I hope you like it. It's gonna be tangy. And you're getting the sweet barbecue. Yep. And we are getting a bunch because it's buy one get one free Thursdays. Yep. Which means I'm eating a lot of breading and carbs, but what is four times? They're doing math. This is what they're doing at dinner. Oh, we're also getting dranky drinks because there's drinks that we want to try. I'm not showing me because my face is. Hold on. It's just, I haven't put anything on after the spa. Say the um, uh, regular old fashioned has filled with cherry in it too. I have a healthy glow going on. Do what? I said the regular old fashioned has filthy cherry in it. I don't know, it must be a type of liquor because it's trademarked. That or it's just a type of cherry. What are you That's getting to drink? The only difference is that one has the bitters and then this one has the Del Magwe Vida Mezcal. Did you tell them what you were getting? I'm trying not um, to get other people. Probably gonna try an old fashioned. And what are you it. what are you ordering for me? Oh, uh, the Moscow Mule. Yeah. We'll see. Because they're easy to recreate at home if we end up liking them. And if not, then we didn't waste a bunch of money on liquor we won't drink. Hey friends. It is now the next day at like 6.30. Uh, we didn't close out last night. So after we had the worst experience at dinner. It took 35, almost 40 minutes before anyone even acknowledged us after we were sat by the hostess. So that was frustrating. Um, anyway, dinner was, it was. After dinner, where'd we go? Um, McDonald's to get us. It was on your face. Oh. No. <laughs> what did we get at McDonald's? So me and Jackson got a vanilla ice cream cone and Daddy got a vanilla shake mm -hmm. and you got an Oreo shake, right? I got an Oreo mini McFlurry, like the little snack size. So anyway, um, that was our night, huh? Mm -hmm. Now, do we want to tell them what we're doing now? Sit down a little bit so I can get you in. There we go. So, so what did Mama surprise you with today? So we got some new mopos. And new, yeah, we got, go grab the pile of stuff. Okay. okay, she's back. Sit down lower. So I went shopping today and I surprised the kids with new art supplies because her art caddy, which is technically hers, but both kids use the supplies out of it. This is how much we got. We're getting rid of those, huh? Because okay. they work. So we're going to just donate them to either a school or take them to drop them off at like donation place. But we like have 
left to school and have to Goodwill. So we went through and tested every marker that was in the drawer. We threw away a ton that were dead. And then those ones still are, they work, but they're not the best. We kept yeah. the best ones, so there wasn't many. So that's our collection of fat markers. We're going to put these 50 fine tip ones in. And what else did we get? So we got some erasable Can you sit colored. down? It's focusing on stuff behind you. There we, we go. We got some erasable colored pencils. pencils. And there's... Can't see your face. Oh, we're not going to go over every word. <laughs> she was going to read you every color. Um, we got a brand new box of what? Clamps. There's 120. So we haven't gone through the pencil drawer yet. This is the pencil drawer. They don't really have many colored pencils, so that'll be a good addition. The crayon drawer, I think I'm just going to dump the entire thing, basically. Because, um, hmm. I mean, we have a few boxes that are new. Um, but the crayon drawer is a mess. I got that for my birthday. You got that for your birthday, yeah. So we're going to put in the brand new. And this is in a tray, so the tray can slide like right into her cat. Anyway, basically we're just here to tell you that we are organizing her caddy while the boys went to a local um, wood shop to get Jackson's derby oh, car oh. cut. So while they're out, we're organizing your fun stuff, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. Let's, and also there's yes. a little U.S.O. peak down there. Yeah. Did we introduce them to Katie? I think we did in one of the recent videos. This is Alice's... Um, if you haven't watched the other video we did a few days ago, um, so this is Katie. And she's a knockoff... Uh, what, what are they called? Reborn? Reborn doll, yeah. She's like five days old. She's five days old. I think so. <laughs> So, all right, anyway, this is what we're doing. We will catch back up with you. I want to show you guys Jack's Derby car when they get home. It's good, just going to be a rough cut, but just kind of filling you all in with what's going on in our busy lives, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very exciting. All right, tell them we'll see you in a bit. We'll see you in a bit, guys. Close your eyes. Oh, we're going to close our eyes. Mm -hmm. Everyone at home closing their eyes, too? Open. Ooh. So this is his rough outline for his derby car that looks pretty cool jack was it cool did you get to watch them cut it yeah yeah and now the worst part of it sanding yeah we warned him he's gonna be sanding a while huh so <laughs> where do i start standing right here <laughs> do you want to start tonight or you want to wait i'll start tonight okay very excited all right. And y'all yeah, was still organizing Hold on, Jack. We're going to have to cut that paper, buddy. That's Bye. way bigger than what you Yeah, have. we're still organizing. So here's her marker drawer. Here's her pencil and pen drawer. And here's her crayon drawer. We did keep some of the old ones if they were still decent. This is a crayon of... sharpener. Yes, it is, isn't it? But the paper needs to be taken off before you can get it. Yep, that's what I told her. New crayons are here, twistables, homemade like little crayons there, and then all of her old ones and the sharpener. That's as far as we've gotten. We still need to go through all this other stuff. It's all like washi tape okay. and stickers and paint. This is and all the stuff that we need to go through. Yeah, now. that's what I just told them. All right, tell them we'll check in with them in a little bit. We'll check in you with me in a little bit. We'll check in you with you. <laughs> we'll check in. Hey, dude. Okay. <laughs> How is your sanding going? So far. Why don't you stop for just a second so we can hear you talk. So you've been sanding a little bit. What do you think about it? Is it hard work? Um, yeah, it's a little bit of hard work for like right here. You have to go like. Yeah. And like here, you go like this in a position. Hold it anywhere you like. I like to do this mm -hmm. when we're doing like the little corners. Sometimes I go like this when we're doing this. Yeah. But I do this. I just start sanding. You're doing pretty good and then, then, huh? And whenever I get a lot on there, I go like this. Here. Dump it out. Very cool. You're putting a lot of elbow grease into this project, aren't you? Yep. That means you're working on it hard. And what are you doing? Just combing this little thing. You got this like last um, Christmas, Dad, like two years ago. <laughs> where, are we gonna, where are we supposed like to Like that? The I found it in the garage. Yeah, the we've got a lot of toys out there because you guys have so many in the house. We finished her art caddy and it looks gorgeous. I'm not going to show you every drawer, but it is cleaned out. Huh. Mm -hmm. Good deal. Why are you laughing? 
has to close it out. I told Daddy he had to close out today's vlog. I'd make a reference, but you wouldn't get it. Probably, because you have a lot of useless information in your head, and I don't keep that kind of stuff. Yeah. Which one of you is going to close it out? Are we going to fight over it? Whoa. Funny, but, 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 me. All right, Allie. So this was yet from like yesterday and a little bit today. So tell them what. Thanks for watching. The but look she just <laughs> gave you. Holy <laughs> fuck. I'm helping. You're supposed to be closing it out. I'm helping. Thank you for watching this video. I said that video. part. Make sure to subscribe, click that like button right down there. Bye.